Hello guys, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to make an entity glow. So basically attracts the survivors to click something. So open up your hammer and open up the map you want to use. Right, so I just got a basic basic square room here. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to click the entity tool, go over to my objects and write in prop and go dynamic. But you can do static if you really want to. Right. No, actually, I think you do need to do prop and go dynamic. So make sure it needs to be a prop dynamic. Go to your world model and pick a object. I'm going to write generator in. Generator in. So switch your one. Click apply and make sure it's the right way. There, give me a second. 37.3. There we go. Right, and just place it up against the wall. So, as you can see here, we just got a basic generator on the wall. I'm just going to add a survivor position here. So, I can see how high it is. And as you see there, it is way too high. As my room is just massive. So, just bring this down to about here. Small, so just adjust it to where you want it to be. Let's see about there. Right. So now that we've got our generator in place, you need to create a button. So click the block tool, go to your textures, write in the filter, no draw, and pick the no draw one. And just draw it over where you want it to glow, or where you want it be pressed because it could be over on the other side of the room and you still get this entity to glow but obviously you want it next to the entity so click control T to tie it to entity and write in funk and skull button right so we need to set up some settings but if you wanted this to glow as you can see there's an option here glow entity and you need to name this what you've named your prop so we haven't named our prop yet. If you go back to your prop and go dynamic, give it a name. We'll say call it glow and go entity. Right, now go back to your funk and go button, go to the option glow entity, and you can either click this toggle thing and click on the prop or just write it in yourself. And click apply. Now in game this should glow up and it should all be working for you. So if I just quickly show us in game. So as you can see guys, um, the entity is glowing, we've done it what it wants, when we click it, it unglows. Thanks for watching guys.